Hey everybody, welcome to A to Z of Oils. This is Tammy Hicks, and today we are talking about lime essential oil. I love this oil. It is um, a citrus oil, obviously. It's very uplifting. It has a great um, aroma to help with um, mood and focus and attention um, in terms of you know giving you some mental clarity. It's a great oil. It's really uplifting, and that's probably one of the, my favorite ways to use it. Um, I love it in the diffuser. I do lime, bergamot, and wild orange um, when I want to get stuff done or when I want to be uplifted. The three of them together that is my favorite um, diffuser blends. I love it. Um, so lime can be good for a lot of things and let me read some of the amazing things that it's good for. So it is an anti-inflammatory, an antiseptic, an antioxidant, antibacterial, a tonic, uplifting, a detoxifier, a disinfectant, and a diuretic. Holy cow, did you know that Lyme could do all those things? So um, one of the ways that I use it, right, so we talk about for um, focus and attention. It's one of the blends that goes into our focus um, rollerball that we use. And inhaling that, again, you get that automatic uplifting mood and the sharpening of the brain, so you kind of wake up right away. Rolling it on the back of your neck, um, applying on the bottoms of your feet is spectacular putting it in the diffuser as well to kind of uplift and help to um, help you focus a little bit more. Um, I also love it when I mix it with peppermint. So if you have an elevated um, body temperature, so peppermint and lime down the spine, bottoms of the feet is really great to bring that body temperature down. So whether you have a body temperature increase from a virus or a bacteria, or if you have an increased body temperature from changes in your hormones, lime and peppermint is spectacular. So down the spine, bottoms of the feet. I love to um, put peppermint and lime in a little spritzer um, and spritz it on the back of your neck if you're overheating. Um, so it's great for that as well. Um, it's also really good for your respiratory system. So it helps to loosen up mucus and stuff like that. So I like it personally, like at night, if you're feeling a lot of extra gunk, you can put some over your lung area on the bottoms of the feet and the reflexology points for your lungs is a great place as well. Um, you can also take it internally, so to help break up some of that mucus. So just putting it in a little veggie cap, or you can put a little bit of it in your water or in a shot glass or however else, just get that internally to help break up some of that mucus. Urinary and digestive issues, again, so putting a drop or something in your water to help clear out and cleanse your urinary tract. Um, mental memory and clarity, we already talked about. Um, Let's see what else. Oh, head lice. This is another way I love to use it um, mixed with melaleuca and cedarwood and a few other fun rosemary. Um, but it is great to, great to deter um, the lovely little insects that a lot of kids get in elementary school. So just spraying that like on the scalp as a deterrent is really great. And um, pain and inflammation. So you can take it in a capsule. It does contain um, increased antioxidants accidents and help to decrease some inflammation. So a lot of really good uses for Lyme that a lot of people don't really know about. So um, I put this in my water. I love the scent. I love cooking with Lyme. So there's a really great recipe I will try to find and attach to our Facebook group, but it's um, nectarine, um, mango, cilantro, um, kind of a salsa with lime essential oil. It is delicious. So um, lots of great ways to use lime. From an emotional standpoint, um, this is really cool. So lime is the oil for zest for life. Um, lime imbues the soul with a zest for life. When individuals have been weighed down by discouragement of grief, Lyme elevates them. Um, it instills courage and cheer in the heart and reminds them to be grateful for the gift of life. It cleanses the heart, especially when there has been an accumulation of emotional toxins due to avoidance or repression. It revital revitalizes the heart space, giving room for light and joy. It can also assist people who have overly developed their intellectual capabilities uh, capacities, but have neglected to develop themselves emotionally. Very interesting. This oil encourages balance between the heart and mind. It clears congestion from the heart region, assisting one in feeling safe and at home in their heart. 
Huh, very interesting. So lime is a pretty cool oil and not one that you might think of can do all these things, but um, I'm telling you, you gotta check it out for yourself and you will probably love it as much as I do. All right, have a good night.